But um, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to episode two of Homie Only Chat. We got uh, Hotline Ching here today. What's up, Ching? How you doing, homie? Doing good. Killing some sand crabs. <laughs> hey, good shit. Good to see it. Yeah, um, yeah, we can just get started. You yeah. yeah. How's it been? Uh, how's it been being a working man now? It's great. I love it. <laughs> I love. I love leaving my house. It's it's awesome. My coworkers, dude. It's like I'm living like like literally the office, like the show. Yeah, wow. it's it's awesome, dude. I sit in a cubicle. <laughs> you, there's you, people around me. Do you like your coworkers? Are they like around your age? No, nah, they're not. They're like in their forties. Okay, okay, okay. Uh-huh. What kind I'm of job the youngest is it? guy there? Uh, just supply chain stuff, data entry. I don't know what to call it. I don't think it's like data entry, data entry. But I'm just ordering stuff. I walk around the factory a lot, make sure we have all the stuff we need. Mm-hmm. I like walking around the factory. I like looking at big machines. You guys, you guys like big machines? Yeah. I mean, it's like a big thing. Yeah. Like we have these John oil rigs. So I think they're oil rigs. I don't know what they are. Oh, over, yeah. in, over in Long Beach. Mm-hmm. And they look like giant dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> That's the yeah. You like pull up on the freeway. They're all like, they have all these big ass <laughs> machines and shit like all around. Mm-hmm. That's dope though. Um, <clears throat> I'm kind of I I I kind of wanted to know because I don't know the story behind this, but like, where did you get your tag from? Like, where did the where did the tag Hotline Chain come from? Um, oh, I, mean, I want I want to say it was it, it's from the song, but it's like Genesis three, I think. Hmm. My tag used to just be Ching, and then I pulled up to my bracket for Genesis, and they were like, "Oh, Ching, where's Ching?" I'm like, "I'm right here," and the guy just goes, "I know when that Hotline Ching." And I was like, oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> I was like, dang. <laughs> that's the coolest thing I ever heard yeah, in my yeah. life. That's so funny. <laughs> really, damn, that guy didn't even know what he did. Mm-hmm. Man. He just he made a know. fucking... He were you like a kid thing. at the time? Like, how old were you? I mean, I was like 19. 19. When was Genesis 3? Like 18. I was definitely on... Uh, it was definitely a lot of fun. Mm. Oh, shit. Yeah. Let, me, let me see. What, I, think, yeah, I think Genesis 3 was like 2016 or 2015. So so what'd you use as like your moniker and like in other games and shit as a kid? Was it Ching related at all? Yeah, everything was basically Ching related. Chingy Changa. Uh, <laughs> in sixth grade, some guy, Herman, used to bully me and call me Chinginator. And then I was like, that's kind of badass. I was about to say, is that a bully? I was, I was like, that's fucking cool. <laughs> that's like a new aim name and shit. <laughs> yeah, so I started using Chinginator. And then uh, I think my first username in RuneScape was ETH308 because uh, you know, you know how I, you, you ever seen the show Zoom? Like, they yeah, just, yeah, like, yeah, on yeah. PBS. The kid's like, yeah. Uh, yeah. Come on and zoom, zoom, yeah. zoom, uh, zoom. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> um, they did, like, this thing where they're like, let's talk in old-fashioned language. I wanteth the popcorn F. And then I played RuneScape, and I was like, this is old-fashioned F. <laughs> <laughs> Put that shit in there. It's <laughs> just saying in 308. Yeah. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> yeah, they're just, just some numbers. Yeah, that's numbers I randomly yeah. put in. Yeah. Um. Well, I, I, one thing I would bring up though, what does your like gaming career look like? For some reason, we have like weird ass mutuals, but they're from like different portions of your life. Do you remember uh, like <laughs> like one of your one one of my homies knew you because of like your fucking like some random clan you were a part of in Maple Story. <laughs> Oh, dude, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, that is that Ching? Oh, dude. That was just Lars, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Lars, <laughs> Lars. I was like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> I was so embarrassed seeing him. I was so cringe. I you was told like me 15 that. 15 when I knew him. Well, he's not and that so much then, older than us. He's like, probably like, he's like three years older. So, yeah, like, you know. but like, I'm 15, you know, they're all like 18, 18 19, 20. Yeah. I'm just like hitting puberty. I'm like, ah, hey, what's up, guys? And <laughs> yeah. I'm just like saying cringe shit. <laughs> just, I, I, that's why I kind of like you know you ever get some person in your chat just saying some out of pocket stuff. Yeah, I was that kid. Uh, <laughs> that I get you. Yeah, like I'm just yeah. I would just say stuff and we'd be in the Skype call and I would just be doing shit just because I don't know why not. It's funny. Uh, <laughs> I think it's funny. I probably would have banned you. A little chinky in my chat and shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I probably would have said some crazy yeah. stuff. Yeah, I was about to say those uh, those kids that be finding their way in the in the chat sometimes. I'm like, damn, bro, this is so. It's always the worst when they just ride that line of like being kind of annoying but not annoying enough to like ban them. I mean, I felt I feel like everyone handles it differently though. Mm-hmm. Like mm-hmm. me, I'm like cutthroat. Yeah. Like if I'm just slightly like, uh, yeah, like I really yeah. like this Get the person. Fuck out of here. Even slightly, I'm like, oh mm-hmm. man, I'm not being paid. <laughs> you know, like dude, this shit doesn't yeah. pay. It's like, yeah. yeah. How do you guys handle that? 
You guys, yeah. you, you guys have like policy. Yeah. I don't have policy. Like, how do you handle like a little kid in your stream and shit? Yeah, I, I, I definitely feel like I'm more, I, I'm more lenient. But then I started hanging out with AJ, and then now I'm like, ah, get the fuck out of here, <laughs> like fucking ban people. And so like, what about you, Ching? Dude, I, you know, I, I'm on TikTok. I get, I get a lot of kids. It's just how it is with Cuphead and stuff, mm-hmm. dude. I, I feel like I'm really good with kids. Yeah, I kind of just mess with them a lot. They're kind of funny to talk to, especially mm-hmm. when they just start. It's all fun and games until they say something bad, bad. <laughs> yeah, you know what I yeah, mean? Like, exactly. They drop, they drop like something very bad. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not gonna say what, but mm-hmm. okay, something yeah. bad. They drop some crazy shit. Yeah, yeah. It's all, it's all literally all fun and games up until that point. But I mm-hmm. kind of just feel like, hey, what's up, man? I've been there. Oh, I, I know what you... you're going through. Mm-hmm. Be cool. <laughs> Be cool, and we're good. You know. Be cool, and we're good. I feel like you've always been better at that than me. But um, yeah. Do you feel like that's? Well, I, I remember like that was kind of a thing back in the day. But do you think that's way more now? Now that you pivoted towards TikTok and like you're making like these Cuphead videos and speed run things, or like yeah, way yeah. more. The 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 age of my audience has dropped drastically, mm-hmm. drastically. Yeah. Like I get like 13, 12. I swear I got I got a nine year old one time. Oh, that's crazy, man. Damn, that's I was like, you gotta get off the site, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> Some bad words. That's the thing. Dude. Nine year olds. <laughs> Holy shit. Bro, my That's favorite right is on. when I'm talking to them and they're like, yeah. oh, I got school tomorrow. Oh, and I'm like, That's fuck. awesome, bro. Like, what grade are you in? You in high school? And he's like, no, nah, I'm in six. Oh, something like that. what I'm the like, fuck? Damn, bro. Oh, my I'm for God. the kids, dude. It's I'm turning school to grade. Hey, hey that's, that's dope, though. Yeah. You know? That is pretty tight. I, I, I feel like you're a good role model. You know? I would, dude, look, uh, up, I would look, look up to you if I was a kid. Yeah, that's why I try. I try. No, I love Keep, Like, um... I was talking. I, I there's this old Smasher. He played Ice Climbers. Like he's been in our scene forever. Called Choke Nader. Yeah, yeah. And uh, uh, I was talking to him, and I was like, I, I we we we've been best buds for a while. And I was like, yeah, dude. When I was like 15, I was talking to you. And you're like 25. Why were you talking to me? Mm-hmm. He's like, I don't know. I'll just help you out. Okay. And I was like, yeah, I got a lot of kids in my chat now too. Like on Twitch, he's asking about that stuff. And he's like, well, yeah. Now they're gonna grow up, and they're gonna have adult Ching fans. Oh yeah, 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 like, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's true. You're right. Yeah, yeah. damn. Passing the torch down. Okay, it's well. like yeah, there's a bunch of like kids. Uh, I mean, I, when I was a kid, I watched a lot of YouTubers. I had a lot of impact. So who, I guess who'd you watch back then? I, I watched a lot of RuneScape videos. Mm. I I, I kind of stopped around uh, like when Markiplier and PewDiePie got big. I, I hated YouTube because I didn't like the gaming stuff. Yeah. Mm. So I was like, I rather dude. I was watching this long form gameplay because I didn't have an Xbox, and I was just like, I don't want to. Terry, shut up. So you're like watching vicariously because you <laughs> you didn't play, mm-hmm. right? I did that and so uh, for like oh my bad. No, 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 I did that for like Last of Us and shit because I don't have a console. Mm. So That's what I did. Those yeah. kinds of games but, are good to like experience through a playthrough through like the like those story those more story based games, you don't really need uh to play it as much. Like it's not as big of a deal. You know, you were you were talking about kind of your audience and how it's shifted a little bit, but where did you sort of start making content? Was that do you start on sort of the socials? Do you start on Twitch, YouTube? Like where did the where did where did the content process start? Twitter. Twitter. Mm, okay, yeah, word. That's where it began. COVID mm-hmm. hit, started shit posting. Me and my friend Max started shit posting. <laughs> Literally exactly exactly like that. Mm-hmm. Like when you say shit posting, like Yeah. What did it memes. Memes like and just, shit. Just memes posting. I think like uh, porn. What's like porn? <laughs> no, not like that. Not like that. <laughs> I was like <clears throat> posting memes every day. I'd post rise and grind gamers, and mm-hmm. then post a photo. I had some bangers, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, and it was a lot of fun. That's how we met most of the people on Twitch right now, or mm-hmm. that's in our on my little group of people. Yeah, on yeah, Twitter yeah. and stuff like that. Wow. So. How did that? How did you sort of like transition that? Did you just start on Twitter and then you're like, okay, I'm just gonna go over to Twitch and like, 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 how did that process sort of start? Yeah, I started stream. <clears throat> yeah, exactly like that. I started streaming because I was like, eh, why not? And then I got my boy Matt Cake to start streaming, mm-hmm. and then he blew up. Yeah. And so in turn, people started going to him, mm-hmm. and then I'm his best boy. I'm his boy. Yeah. People start coming to me, uh-huh. and so it's like I'm the tier down from him. Like if you <laughs> if you got deep into the community, you came to me. Yeah. But if you're a surface level, you went to Cake. <laughs> yeah, I feel that. I mean, I'm tier two. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't see like that though, because like my all the people I like I know in the community and stuff is like I met them initially from you, but I met them from uh like way back in the day. Like well, this is like twenty. I don't want to age myself. 2019, probably? 20, 2019? <laughs> yeah. I met Jamie Park. He doesn't stream anymore, mm. by the way. 
But I went to his stream and he was like, no, dude. Uh, thanks, Smasher, for coming to my stream. My my like my other homie I have is Hotline Ching, but to me, I was, I I think you were like established already. I was like, oh shit, I'm mm-hmm. trying to get like that guy. That guy has a that guy has a community. Yeah, and I'm like streaming to like two people and shit. And I'm like, oh damn. <clears throat> but yeah, no, I think I usually I don't think you're like a, a tier below, but like mm-hmm. I always consider you like you as a core piece. And oh yeah, piece not like a tier area. below. Like I think I was the. <clears throat> He had the he had the followers. I network. Oh, yeah. okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that was like I kind of like we're 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 best friends. It's, yeah, 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 like, yeah. Well, of course, it's, 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 it's all so kind of bounce off each day, other yeah. pretty well too. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah. Like I I knew like I, I'm deep ingrained in Twitch. I've been here since like 2011, man. Damn, so, like, I kind of knew what was up. Wow. And he yeah he was he he wanted to start streaming, so I kind of showed him how to do it and stuff like that. So when did you actually start streaming? I think like 2019. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. But you were like watching. But you were, you've been on Twitch since like 2011. Yeah. Okay. Oh, because of League of Legends. Mm. Oh, okay, okay. Who were some watching. of those League streamers you were watching? Bro, Odd One, Dyrus, Chaos. Oh, yeah. The OGs. Yeah. The OGs. Mm. Anything TSM, then Scara, yeah. PewDiePie. Facts. Cutie, that's what, that was my boy, yeah. Maybe, I just watched Silence Barn all the time. Mm. Yeah, dang. That's, that, that, that is some deep cuts right there before I even became Dart or uh, what's it called? Whatever his current tag is. But um <clears throat> yeah i think that's uh i think that's actually pretty dope like when you um when you sort of started streaming did you find that like the 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 community that you had sort of built up on twitter was sort of similar to like what was it was it the same interacting with them on twitch was it more fun like what was that kind of interaction like yeah more fun <clears throat> more one to one, especially because we were just in Discord all the time. Yeah, so it was about the same. Mm-hmm. You know, there's really no difference except uh, now you're one person commanding everybody, <laughs> and then, and <laughs> yeah, then yeah, everyone yeah, sure. has fun. Everyone uh-huh. has fun. Everyone's yeah. involved. You know, yeah. I that's why that. I just like getting everyone involved. I think that's mm-hmm. the most fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now you always do that. Like, uh, remember you invite invite us to like the Minecraft shit. Uh, what other events did you have? Yeah. I, I I participated in the Minecraft one. Did the quarantinis. Oh, was, was you, you were there for that. I don't remember. Dude, uh, during quarantine, I had two award shows. Oh, for, like the the <laughs> <Nah>. quarantine. <laughs> I called the quarantine. We were quarantined, and I was like, as soon as quarantine ends, this ends. And yeah, yeah. Quarantine ended. Yeah, and I yeah, was like, yeah, all right, yeah. sorry guys. Yeah, uh, <laughs> no more quarantinis. What, what what kind of award show? Was, like, what what was it? <clears throat> I was giving out awards. I kind of <laughs> made them up. Yeah, oh, yeah. Like, if I saw someone in the chat, like mm-hmm. like Smasher, if you if I saw you in the chat, I'd be like. All right, guys. Hey, best melee player I know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Get him over it just, here. yeah, it was just yeah, just fucking freestyling it. That's actually so funny. Yeah, dude, he but, would throw uh, like random events, and I was just like, oh man, I'm down. And he he did like, uh, who wants to be a millionaire? <laughs> oh, sick. And he'd oh, have like, sick. uh, what else, what else were they? It was like, tell. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, a shit league, I did a rock yeah, league yeah. tournament. And wow. He, he would do stuff like uh. You give your address and you would like send over like cards and stuff. You did one recently, but you've done that in the past. Or like, did you ever like a PO box or something? Or yeah, I still got it. Okay, I've okay. been paying for it. Haven't been using it. How um, much? How much is that? It's like forty eight bucks every three months. Okay. So that's like tw- like not that bad. I mean, yeah, I make that not- like that's in a day. I always want to do that, but I'm scared. Like fucking, I'm gonna open something and cockroaches <laughs> come out. Here's shit. Like, send you some crazy like, shit. Oh, thanks, man. Thanks for uh, the fucking bugs. Mm-hmm. That'd be sick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I am um, <clears throat> like. So when you started streaming in 2019, what were what was like the content that you were streaming? Were you doing just chatting? Were you playing melee? Like what were you? What did you get into initially? Bro, my first game was Jet Set Radio, but I really started popping off when wow. I was playing Toontown. Oh, oh fun. Toontown, bro! Dude, I I was running the Toontown Twitch. I had like 30 viewers, Damn. all just Toontownians. <laughs> I would do. I was degenerate back then. I I didn't. I was talking to my friend about it because I remember we had a 24 hour stream. Where all I did was smoke weed and drink on play Toontown Town for twenty four hours, and I just remember my friend Gage coming in, going like, "This dude's faded as fuck." <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Dude, shut up!" Yeah. That's cool. everyone, when was that? Everyone fucked with it. Quarantine? Uh, like quarantine time? I don't know when or it was. Before actually. that, it was, like might have been before that. Yeah, it's like a little, like a little beforehand, right? Twenty nineteen. It was a long yeah. time ago. Mm. Dude, I tried streaming that game recently. Toontown? Town? Yeah, the thing oh, is, wow. I didn't grow up with it. So like, mm. oh, I did. Yeah. I, ca- I came in and I was like, "What the fuck is this yeah. game?" <laughs> I feel that. I remember loving that show when I was a kid. Like, I didn't even know there was a Twitch scene like that for for Toontown, though. I mean, there's for any <laughs> fucking 
Damn. Oh, shit. Oh, I got the, from the, the physical copy. Yeah. The, I bought a minute ago. I don't know where the physical copy is. Did you just have that right next to you? Like he had that yeah, ready. He have it on me. <laughs> he got knew. It on me 24/7, bro. He knew. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's actually so fucking funny. I have a question. Mm-hmm. What else? What's your yeah, late on me? Yeah, what's your what's your current relationship with like content stuff in Twitch? I know you're. I I'm working. You know I I, I know mm-hmm. the feel, but like, is it kind of like because you're pushing out a lot of stuff? You were, you were we were streaming a lot during quarantine. Mm-hmm. But like, you think it's kind of like you know, more of a hobby now, or like you know here and there. I like YouTube more. I'm YouTube on YouTube more. now. Mm. Twitch, not as much. I feel like, uh, I don't know, like, uh, I'm really, I really miss quarantine Twitch. Yeah, it hit yeah. different. And now it's like, I feel like it's not as fun. Like, <laughs> I, I still love it. I still love it. But something about everyone was in quarantine. You know, I had all the boys there. Like, yeah. <clears throat> like Cake was streaming all the time. If you remember, Lame is Chris. Yeah. That yeah. was my boy. You were there. Fods. Like, we just, uh, we just had the boys, you know, it was, it was sick. It was mm. sick. Yeah. I, and then I, now yeah. it's like, uh, I don't know, man. I think, I think I'm, honestly, it probably is. I'm just growing up. It has to be it. Yeah. I, uh, fuck man. I, I, I like talking about this. Cause I like, actually, I get sentimental a little bit. Kind of like how you're talking about that. It's like, it, it's like when you first start, you come in with a, and you have a whole community and stuff, but if you outlast the community, and they, you know, they, they kind of move on too because like quarantine or whatever reason people are growing up and shit. Mm-hmm. It's kind of tough. It's like I, I feel like a it sounds corny. It's like no, no. you know those movies where like you're a Dracula. I don't know, like a fucking <laughs> <laughs> like, you, like you don't die or something. You're like yeah. you're eternal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, so yeah. like you know. I remember I started streaming and I was kind of figuring it out on my own. And then I, I met a community. We all got into <clears throat> streaming during quarantine, and then they stopped streaming. A new batch of people are like, "Oh, I'm getting into streaming." And I'm just like an old man. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. like, yeah, I, I know. <laughs> mm-hmm. And they're talking like, "Oh, I want to do this and do this." I'm like, "Yeah, yeah, you should." Mm-hmm. But secretly, yeah, I'm like, "Oh, that. fuck, dude, you know." <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Dude, I've seen this oh, shit a hundred oh, no. times. You know? I'm, the, I'm the new wave. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like, oh, uh, but I do get that though. Mm-hmm. It's like very, like, yeah. very reminiscent. Yeah, you like have your you have like your OGs, and then you 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 stream long enough that like new people start mm-hmm. coming in, and then like the same the old people like aren't there as much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. It's, it's mm-hmm. it, it it it's just how it is, you know. Yeah, yeah, it's how it is. Yeah, you know, yeah. life moves on. Yeah, life moves quarantine's over. over. That's why I'm streaming less because honestly, I just want to go out and do stuff. Like mm-hmm. I want to go. Like I play the One Piece card game a lot. I want to go to my locals. Yeah, I want to yeah. go play melee with my friends. I want to go tournaments. Yeah, yeah. I want to like you know leave the house. Yeah. You know why not? Uh, yeah. I feel like, uh, but uh, I've been trying to get I've been trying to get better at living in the moment. Just no, like, hey, I, I you like know, that. if I want to do shit today, you know, I'll, I'll if I feel like it, I'll do it. Mm-hmm. If I feel like it, I'll do it. That's that's what I say to myself. If I really wanted to stream, I would do it. Yeah, but yeah. I just yeah. Wish yeah. Mm-hmm. no, I I like that mindset. Yeah, I'm trying to pivot over that. I'm trying to go to more of my locals. Like I I stream <clears> a lot of melee, but I don't really feel like close with SoCal. You know. So I'm mm-hmm. trying to change that. I'm like, oh, I, I meet all the people and kick it and shit. Mm-hmm. But it's definitely different than what it was when I was, you know, starting out. I was like some little fun. kid and shit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Yeah, yeah. It yeah. was awesome. Yeah. Like, I could probably still try and do the stuff I used to do, but I don't know. I feel like it just wouldn't hit as hard. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We, I, we just had like the perfect group of people, like perfect group. Yeah, yeah. But you still uh, keep, up, keep in touch with all of them, right? Sort of. Yeah, everybody. Like, yeah, 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 everybody. Yeah. Do do you feel like your homies still stream kind of the same amount or as much as before? Or do or has has your core group kind of fallen off of that shit too? Like they're all gone. Damn. Lamus Chris gone. Uh, Cake. He he's he streams at night, so I can never catch him. He streams like eleven p.m. Mm. Yeah, I was and about to say I've seen Cake. Smashes on. Mm-hmm. Nah, that's about it. Yeah, that's only off top. That's some of the main ones I watched. Uh, yeah. no one really I know that like. Like that isn't like new streaming mm-hmm. back like that was stream- so streams today. Yeah. What I liked a lot about this community was like Twitch is huge, you know, there's a shit ton of people. But I don't think there's that many people I want to actually talk Kick to. It. Yeah. <laughs> like there's not that many people it's I would actually want to spend time with. Like I could go through just chatting, like fucking scroll through that shit. I'm like, damn, I wouldn't want to talk to any of these people. Yeah. It's like actually, in yeah, that in that small circle of like Twitch, it was like these really interest interesting individuals. Like I would laugh my ass off going to your stream, going to Max's stream. Fucking I go on Fod's stream, I'm fucking cracking up. Why making like yeah. a, a quesadilla? He's like mumbling random shit. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, dude, fucking love these people. 
Oh, Dude, yeah. Boz was the most random me ever. Uh huh. Because uh, he knew all the OG RuneScape YouTubers, and there's one I used to watch called Excel, and he introduced me to Excel, and I was like, <laughs> oh, Boz, shit. what the fuck? How do you know Excel? <laughs> <laughs> I watched him when I was like eight. That's Dude, crazy. I'm 20, like 23 now. What the fuck? He needs a wife. I remember he quit YouTube because he had a wife and kids. Fucker. Oh, shit. Damn. <laughs> that idiot. Uh-huh. <laughs> I was about Seriously, to say, bro. I, I kind of wanted to ask about the YouTube stuff more, too, because, you know, you say you're on YouTube. You're, like, making more content in other places now other than Twitch. Do you feel like it is sort of scratching that similar itch that Twitch kind of used to? Or is it, like, something different entirely, you feel like? Definitely better. Definitely it, the same scratch. Because, like, uh, I got to put a lot of effort into the video. And when back in the day, I used to put a lot of effort into Twitch, and so it's just kind of something I can put effort into. Cause I don't know if I if I have downtime, I get really anxious. Yeah, like yeah. I don't know what it is. I couldn't tell you. But if I'm sitting there doing nothing, I I'm like, mm-hmm. do something. Yeah, gotta yeah, go clean. Yeah. Gotta go do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a good outlet to sort of put your put your energy into. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When did you feel like that itch like started being? Like, I don't know. You started like feeling fulfilled doing youtube i i still haven't hit that yet i'll post something I'm like eh, this shit. It, it's <laughs> like you know, video yeah, but banger, <laughs> videos go it, go, yeah. bang, go uh you know the numbers look good and shit or numbers are looking great okay, i almost okay. have my first million view wow. oh. damn. damn 876k yeah damn. that's crazy fuck dude change big time man i i I want to be honest. Like 15k I, subscribers, damn. baby. Let's Dude, go. you're fucking killing it. That's amazing. Are you actively working on it? Because like, it's hard as fuck working and doing the shit afterwards. You know. Oh yeah. Well, now that I'm not, because I'm kind of, I don't know. I haven't said it yet, but I'm just, I just haven't been streaming because I'm just like, I'd rather make a video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's more yeah. fun. Mm-hmm. I smoke weed and make videos too. there isn't yeah. much else to do yeah it. yeah that's yeah. tight it's nice yeah that's that's so interesting like what do you feel like was sort of the the hardest part about like the youtube grind because for me i feel like youtube is very hard at the start because you putting in like a such a disproportionate amount of work to get like 20 views and then you're like fuck (laughs) so it's like what do you feel like the hardest part of that sort of whole process was finding your style finding your niche Mm. because i did every freaking that's why i don't i didn't like the the whole i mean i love ludwig but he kind of ruined like uh he did it so well now, you know, every like Twitch to YouTube streamer was just putting in the same thing, like, like, what's up, guys? Oh, I'm live today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, doing yeah. this. Oh, shoot. Or whatever they're doing. Like, oh, I ate a one million Scoville gummy bear. Oh, yeah. Yeah, wow. yeah, yeah. Like, and their faces are done like that. And it's just like, oh, I don't give a fuck, fuck about thumbnail. you. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I don't know you. You know, yeah, like, uh-huh. Ludwig, it would make sense to put your face in the thumbnail. But honestly, like if I see some random person, like I don't know, I don't know if it's just me, but mm-hmm. if I see a random person's face in a thumbnail that I don't know, I'm just not gonna click it. Yeah, yeah. And I kind of, I think I found a good formula because I started making Cuphead videos, and instead of my face, I would go to the Cuphead show and I'd screen cap reaction faces from Cuphead or Mugman, mm-hmm. and I'd slap them in the thumbnail. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then people are like, Cuphead. Whoa, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's mm-hmm. a funny face. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I love, uh, I love Ching for this because like. I would play Animal Crossing at fucking like 2 a.m. or something. It's like, you know, you know, like you're lost in your thought and shit. And like, no one's actually, it's like quiet as hell. But you're just doing it. Mm-hmm. There's a reason why you're up anyways, doing that, you know, playing. I'm just there. Ching's giving me all this, like, putting me on game. <laughs> He's like telling me all these things, like, dude, you gotta hop on this shit. <laughs> mm-hmm. You gotta do this. I'm like, oh, shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I proceed not to do it. And like, <laughs> I keep it in my head, like, oh, this is cool. This yeah. is good. I need to know this. Putting you on the way. And I was like, oh, oh man. It's like, it's like yeah, you know, be, work ethic is a part of it too. It's like, damn, yeah. definitely, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Dude, I'll, I'll just be high as hell in your chat at two AM, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I've been sitting there smoking weed, like, yeah. oh fuck yes, yeah. yeah. matches online. Yeah. <laughs> just go Ten hang. viewers, fuck yeah, yeah. I can type yeah. All I want. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm just fucking like, yeah. like quietly like working on my on my uh, not farm, but like yeah. my my vill- uh, my city yeah, town. Yeah, yeah, that's how long yeah. it's been. I haven't fucking played that shit. Yeah, my island. Like, yeah. Oh, hey, Jing. Yeah. yeah tippy tap away yeah. so you you were kind of talking about you know like your finding your niche and sort of sort of your style do you feel like that was brought on by like any sort of influences like any content creator influences or were you just kind of like i'm just i'm just that guy i just got my own style no there's this youtuber called quinn bobin he has mm. like 200k subscribers and he did this thing that blew my mind that i completely stole from him 
So like, I, I don't know that there's a term for it, but you know, like when someone's talking and they're like, Hey, what's up guys? Today we're going to do this. Yeah. Oh, and then it zooms in or something like that. And then it zooms out again, you know? <laughs> he did it live without editing. editing. Yeah, dude. That was fucking that's pro that's pro level shit right there. Dude, I got it down. Yeah. But he, he was playing Breath of the Wild and he did it with Link. Like he was talking as Link and he was oh. like, What's up, guys? And zoom mm-hmm. into Link's face and yeah. zoom out. Mm-hmm. Today we're playing Breath of the Wild. Yeah. But and I was like, that's fucking genius. Uh-huh. I've never seen that before anywhere else. Yeah. And so then I, I grabbed Mugman, zoomed it. <laughs> yeah. Like I'm Mugman. Yeah. And I started calling it the Mugman Nation. Mm-hmm. And everyone loves that. Oh, Everyone's okay. eating it up. Everyone's mm-hmm. eating it up. That's so funny. Yeah. I love it too. Yeah. I are you still really passionate about Odd Cuphead right now, or have you kind of changed gears on like other not topics, I still but... am, but if I play too much, I get really bad carpal tunnel. My, my oh. hands actually hurt. Dude, that's mm. fucked. Cause you play melee too. Like you play mm. melee and then you do that shit. Well, it's because I use the fu- I, I this, this can't be good for your hands, bro. Like when I'm playing, stick? you, you know, use play a fight stick for it? Yeah, I use a fight stick. Crazy. And oh, so, like, yeah. you know, my hand my hands like curled like this, yeah, and my wrist yeah, yeah, is like yeah. a Terrible position. Terrible position. Yeah. Wow. I never but even just, could have thought about doing something like that. Like that seems so hard. <laughs> you, so you know all what this, actually gave me. Oh, you can go. You can go. I was gonna say all those challenges you've done. Like you know, other than like once with your feet and stuff. Like specific ones like that. Like were these all done? Like on the on the fight stick when you're playing? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, oh, I can, shit. I'm what? really good at cuffing. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, I, yeah. I'm, I'm really fucking uh-huh. good. I, I sell my show. I sell my self short a lot but i'm actually uh-huh. easily like top 50 player in the world oh fuck yeah, yeah, yeah. i know you're easily good as fuck bro, right? yeah wow well, what were you saying before that before i distracted you i was yeah. gonna say you know what i actually gave me like permanent like arm damage the challenge that i did so i did like, a mashing thing on tiktok i saw you know, that like, shit. Mario Party domination where you mash oh yeah, yeah literally yeah. like i have pain in my elbows from that because i mashed every day holy it's, like, right here dude and so, like when i mash with like mm-hmm. ices i feel it <laughs> oh yeah. my god Holy! D- those popped off though. <laughs> they did pop off. You know yeah, what's dude. crazy, dude? Five million likes from those easily. I got like hundred k followers from that. I only made six hundred dollars from what? all those views, dude. And I I cleared over fifty million. I cleared over fifty million views, and I got six hundred. Is that gonna happen? Is that just how the monetization on TikTok works? It's TikTok, yeah. What? What the fuck? That's insane. I can't even. Is I, it better now yeah. or no? No, <laughs> actually, I don't know. <laughs> Now they made a 50 50, but I haven't had any bangers like that to actually make me money. So, yeah. what was it back then? What, what, what does that 50 like, 50 mean? What was that? A... Well, I think it's like 50 50 revenue split, you know, like ads. But back then, it used to be they pulled all the money they made together from ads and they would just pop it off to people. Like, oh. like a certain percentage for each per, like the flat percentage across the board for everybody. Mm-hmm. And they would just split the money, not evenly, but based on your views. Damn. Actually, I don't know. I think it was like less, like they took, obviously, took some money, but like, then they took like the rest and just like burst it. Oh shit! We we're wow. going to do it. Yeah. How how does YouTube like work? Is it better? Oh, dude. YouTube juice is my pockets, bro. Dude, he's like uh, inspiring me. I'm like, yeah. I was about to. I'm like, stop it. Yeah, I was about to say that <laughs> YouTube is sounding kind of good, bro. <laughs> my my first YouTube check one k one k straight up. Oh, I got the grand, wow. bro. And then I, now for the other three months, it was like 800, 500, 500. Mm-hmm. Damn, so pretty damn good. Do you remember? Okay, actually, you can totally decline to answer this if you don't want to. I'm by the way, not like, answer anything. Yeah, but do you remember like the numbers you were pulling for the one K check, like when they sent you the one K? Do you remember? I want to say because, like, when I first started opening Cuphead, I was in the algorithm, and yeah. my first one popped off like like three hundred K, and then each video was getting like hundred K views. Wow! And so I think it was like. Like maybe like like around like I'll just ballpark it like maybe like five hundred k views or like Damn. maybe even less yeah, like yeah, or three hundred yeah. I couldn't yeah. tell you. Mm-hmm. But still, like compared to TikTok, yeah, that's because you're getting yeah. millions on TikTok and that shit is see you're getting six hundred. That's like that's insanity. Yeah, it, and the lot of the money I couldn't even get yet because I wasn't monetized yet. I wasn't a partner. Oh like, shit! I wasn't like like the first video that popped off the twist up. It's almost in a million now. Like I wasn't uh, I wasn't partner for a they, lot of those. They views. don't bring that back to you. Like would you? Which your old essentially doesn't come to you, or like you weren't no, you had, you, have to, you have to set ads on the video. Ah, okay. You, yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, physically yeah. click ads and stuff like that. Yeah, mm-hmm. you choose to have them. Is that the only way to make money off of TikTok itself? Like clicking ads, or is, fuck, yeah. They they have gifts oh, like okay. uh like it's not subs, you know, mm-hmm. but like you can like like TikTok lives. I made like some money off those just because mm-hmm. TikTok lives were funny. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But like people can gift you stuff like like bits basically. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a similar sort of thing. Can yeah. that only happen on live too, or 
No, they can do it in comments now, but oh. it's only rolling out to certain people. Mm. Like, uh, you can like do super comments and stuff, where it's like you donate like to the video itself, you know, basically. Mm. Damn, you're actually, yeah. like, you know that this is a podcast. I'm like sitting here, I'm like fuck, man. Yeah, so I need to get on that shit. About, <laughs> yeah, 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 I'm about to say, I'm not asking this for the people. I'm, yeah. I'm fucking, I'm yeah. trying to get the knowledge Loki right now. Like, fuck, dude, I'm just, <laughs> I'm trying to get the juice class right now. He's like teaching me and shit. He's teaching us, bro. What's that name? What's that dude who's like in my garage? Knowledge. Oh, Luke, knowledge. Ty, oh, yeah, Ty Lopez. <laughs> Ty, Ty, Lo- Ty Lopez last fucking Ty 10 Lopez, years. Yeah. I just read 100 books today. <laughs> teaching me this well, that's, shit. That's literally me right now. I just read 100 books today. Because all I do at work is I sit there and listen to my audio books 24-7, dude. Right. But yeah, I love talking about this stuff. So any questions yeah, you yeah, have? Yeah, no, no. I love like my, my life. Literally, my life is work and then YouTube mm-hmm. and then like RuneScape or Melee. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's Because like, dude, I was playing TFT like every day. I love that I was shit. just like, and then I, I was like, bro, what the fuck? Like, I'm getting nowhere in life. Mm-hmm. I gotta do something productive. And then I started playing Melee, and I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> productive. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. God damn. Yeah. I hate that I understand what you're talking about. I know the yeah, field, too. I'm making bro. progress. Yeah. In reality, is like, yeah, I'm making fucking... progress. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I'm not doing jack shit. <laughs> I've been I've been doing uh you know your you know Uncle Punch the mod mm-hmm. yeah yeah of course like, yeah do they have exercise mm-hmm. I read I was in the Icy's Discord oh dude I have the funniest thing to show you too oh I my see god we're talking yeah, about yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay I'll tell you after I'll tell you later we'll, okay we'll, yeah. it's downstairs I gotta grab it but okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. um Wait, some guy was just like bro do exercise a thousand eggs a day and I was like oh shit <laughs> <laughs> I gotta do exercise a thousand eggs a day bro <laughs> or I'm a scrub eggs. like oh shit yeah. he's and bitten so right like, now every night before bed I sit there and I exercise a thousand eggs dude no oh, like, fucking way on there bro I do short hops dash dance these <laughs> things short, so short hop funny. up air short hop back airs uh, Any, if- anything I can think of to do I'm yeah. mixing it up and everything bro it works dude bro. the other day I was telling my friend I'm like I'm like three weeks deep into my Icy's adventure Dude, the other day, um, my my friend Bryce came through to play me. Dude, every time he felt any time he did any Falco aerial, I'd short hop out of shield back air. Yeah, I was I was you I was fucking dicing ready. him up, bro. It's like a yeah, fucking kung fu routine, <laughs> <laughs> dude. Damn. He just fucking sees eggs when he's punishing. Uh-huh. Now. It's like in the fucking <laughs> yeah, in, the, in the cartoons when they're hungry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He dude. just sees the eggs. <laughs> it's oh, crazy shit. you say that because like the eggs spawn and drop down. Yeah, and he was exactly. Falco, and he went hella high up in the air and dropped down, and I was like, I'm locked in, yeah. bro. <laughs> <laughs> and I backered the hell out of him. Like, yeah, he was like, like oh, fuck, that bro. Was Target switching his shit. <laughs> Uh, uh, like, I think there nice, is bro. there yeah. is merit to that. Yeah. I have been grinding eggs too, but like mine's just casual. I'm like mm-hmm. fucking just doing nothing. But you're like doing a thousand, yeah, a thousand, thousand eggs, a eggs a day is a shit. Because like yeah, Dude. to put it in context, like one round you're getting like. 30, 30 40 yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like 30 you're good yeah yeah, yeah like but your ice oh, is no, too like oh i do i do non-stop eggs. oh you oh, okay, do non-stop yeah, okay, yeah, 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 i do yeah, non-stop yeah. okay okay yeah. that's but, still uh, fucking yeah. a lot that's still uh, impressive as shit uh, but yeah that's uh, dude, i'll do like i'll do like 10 minutes of only back airs 10 minutes of only dash dance d sinks to hit eggs and then 10 minutes of only up airs yeah. and the last time is just whatever like I'll just try and aim and shit. <laughs> Low key, I was like, "Ching, we should play some games." And now I'm kind of scared. <laughs> I was about to say, I, I said that too. I'm like, ah, maybe not. I'm scared to play this dude. <laughs> not, uh, you guys will still mop me, uh, definitely. <laughs> My neutral sucks, bro. Uh, no, you guys no, get man. in on, dude. More down till. What do I do? <laughs> yeah, I, play, I play Falco now, though. Yeah. You know. True. I'm Falco. Falco. What am I gonna do? Yeah. Dude, I don't I'm know. You've been, do. you've been yeah. tracking the eggs and shit. Yeah. That's eggs only get me so far. Uh-huh. King's, King's ready, man. He's he's that's. I think that's so funny that you say that too. Like you're talking about, you know, like you're playing other games and then you don't feel productive, but then you hop on melee and you're like, oh yeah, I feel like that's. Just, I feel like melee just has that fucking effect. Like mm-hmm. it feels like mm-hmm. you're. It, it, it's funny that you like made the kung fu joke earlier, AJ, but it definitely feels like a martial art kind of thing. Yeah, it's like yeah. there's so much like self mastery in that shit. Like you have to put in a lot of time and like try to fucking up your up your skills whether it be punish like neutral all that shit definitely makes a huge difference because i got an i got into melee off that shit like i was like off a breakup and i was like fuck i need to put some Mm -hmm. i need to put some energy into something i need to like start lifting weights or do something and i just was like all right fucking i'm gonna hop on melee that's my story too really that's that's literally i got into pm because of a breakup i did not know that oh i was fucking Mm -hmm. it wasn't because of a breakup Mm -hmm. but it was more like you know after a breakup i was like Oh, what am I gonna do now? You know mm-hmm. <laughs> exactly. I'm just like fuck. <laughs> and I saw a documentary or some shit. I, well, I saw the I saw the, the Smash documentary. Yeah, and then like, 
I didn't know how to get melee, and PM only made sense because I had a Wii. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. then I just hit up people on fucking Facebook. I was like, uh, the SoCal PM community is like, anyone want to come to my house and play mail, uh, play PM? And that's literally how it started. Mm-hmm. And I met Dustin that way. Oh, yeah, really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. Yeah. That's, that's fun. How, how did you How did you end up getting into into melee, Jing? Oh, um, there is a, a tournament happening at Mountain Mike's. <laughs> in my town in 2014 mm-hmm. and i saw it on facebook this randomly popped up and i was like smash bash i play smash and then i was like pm and i was like what's pm i have to download pm now so then i downloaded pm and i got my friends I'm like we're playing pm now we're going to this tournament and then uh yeah history yeah. ever since that's where i met like uh all my great actually the, my best friends i've met there like all the whole group of best friends are still that I'm hanging out with after this podcast. Actually. Oh shit! Yeah, oh, wow. yeah, yeah. Bryce, Bryce, I'll tell you about. I'll yeah, tell you about I play. I met I Bryce, met right? Him at the first Smash Bash. Yeah, you met Bryce. Yeah, you met yeah, Bryce. yeah. Mm-hmm. That's a homie. He came to the the show. Yeah. Oh yeah. He hella met him. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I met him in. I met him in 2014. Yeah. Back oh, at the first God. Smash Bash, Damn. he won. And oh I, shit! I'm roommates actually yeah, yeah. <laughs> with my friend Mason, who um also was at the first Smash Bash. He's my roommate now, and my friend my friend Hunter, uh, who I. <laughs> <laughs> he was just one of the first guys that, like, uh, the guy was like, we got to play Melee. We got to play PM. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And he, my friend came to He's also my roommate. Yeah. Damn, oh, that's hey. fucking crazy. The homies are still a lifetime, I guess. They're yeah. Also, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're also pretty active in Melee. Or, like, or playing mm, Mason it. is. Mason okay, and Bryce. Okay. Yeah. But they just play, like, me. Stuff like yeah, that, you know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. When I'm active, they're active, basically. Because mm-hmm. I feel like uh, our group needs that one catalyst. Because we have these, I have these two friends, PJ and Alex. And they're just hella good. They always play. But yeah. I feel like if anytime I start playing, I'm like, guys, we got to fucking play. Yeah. And I'm like, come over now. Like, come over now. Come over every day. <laughs> yeah. Come over every day and play. So then everyone starts playing Melee. Dude, I love that. That's a, yeah. I, I, I do really do fucking love that shit. Like, the community aspect of Melee, especially, like, I think there's definitely something to be said about, you know, like, the people I've met on Twitch and from Melee and shit like that, I feel like I'm way closer to than people I went to school with and have known, like, all these fucking years. And it's just like that. And it's not even about the melee necessarily. Like AJ and I hang out all the fucking time. We haven't played melee together mm-hmm. in like three weeks or something. Like yeah. I don't even know. So it's just like you know that's the that's the that's the gateway, you know. And then you got and then you got the fucking homies in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, especially it's like nice. homies like you could hang out with that you guys aren't only talking about melee. You know, mm-hmm. like life mm-hmm. life outside of that shit. Yeah. Like you know, just normal life shit. Mm-hmm. Yep. I've gone to dinner yeah. with people like that, and it's like they only talk about like oh, you're you're eating Korean barbecue like so. We, you know, what do you guys usually do against you know a Falco who's like wave landing? That's like, yeah, I'm like, bro, yeah. I'm like, come on, man, dude, I'm trying to fucking fuck eat ruin this the game vibe. Yeah, bro, I don't want to talk about this shit right now. Yeah, that's hell funny. Yeah. yeah, I've never asked my friend that question before mm-hmm. in my life. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to say, hey, bro, what do you think about the matchup, bro? <laughs> <laughs> that's the that's question I was yeah. it's like, uh huh. It's like, uh, well, I'm, you know, I'm just trying to eat my KBB right now, bro. <laughs> like, Unless, like, we're yeah. at Genesis. Yeah, exactly. Like, like if you're at a melee. You know, yeah. yeah. If you're at, like, a, <laughs> a poster film. Yeah, a poster film. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Bad yeah. Yeah. Omen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't I've know how to shoot it. It's okay. Yeah. I've been reading this book called The Alchemist. I'm almost done with it. Oh, my, all my sister talk about it. good omens and bad omens. Mm-hmm. I don't know, man. Yeah, that's that's, <laughs> that's, that's safe, something. Bro. Something. Something's going I'll on. Be safe. Yeah, but you know, on the on the topic of a uh, uh, community, a little bit, I, I actually kind of like you know, I've been wanting to ask because, especially you know, AJ was kind of telling me like he's met so many people through you and like all these like, and you were kind of talking about networking earlier. Like, what do you feel like the uh, the process was like, like from where you started to like where you are now with you know how you built up such a like strong community of like homies who are. You know, like just around. God damn it, just in the background. <laughs> I saw her walk by. Jill, please don't <laughs> fucking do it. Okay, okay. Wait, on, uh, like on Twitch or IRL? Like which, uh, which one do you Twitch, mean? Twitch, Twitch, Twitch. Yeah. Twitch. Dude, I, I don't know, man. I'm just a chronic. I have no fear when it comes to chat rooms because, mm-hmm. like, did I grew up in chat rooms. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, ever since I, like, dude, I remember fucking this. When, you guys remember watch Avatar The Last Airbender? Of course. Yeah, like, yeah. You, I love of that course you have. Yeah, of course. Of course. Yeah. Uh, for some reason, I found a website when the final season was airing. It uploaded the episodes a week earlier than they aired. And so I'd be on there watching it. And there was a tiny little chat room at the bottom. Oh. And I'd always just be in there like typing 24-7, dude. Uh-huh. Like I've been on a RuneScape, Maple mm-hmm. Story. There's yeah. a super old website. It's like it's like X like XNAT or something like that. I, c- mm-hmm. I couldn't tell you the name. Yeah, yeah. But it was like the super old chat rooms that I'd be in. Mm-hmm. And 
Like, I don't know, man. And so, like, when I was on Twitch, I, I was obsessed with Twitch. My yeah. Shit, I get obsessed with it. So, I'd be like, any any one of my recommended, I go in there and talk to them. And, like, I think like any anytime they raided, anytime someone raided into them, I talked to them. Yeah. And yeah. then I streamed, and I had a good network of people. So, I think that kind of drew them towards me also. Because... Mm-hmm. It's just a good time. You yeah, know, yeah, it's like, yeah, uh, yeah. It was you, genuine. You join, you, you hang out with us, you know, it'll be, you'll have a great time on Twitch. You know, it'll yeah, be yeah. hella fun. Mm-hmm. And I, I feel like the more the merrier. That's, you know, it's just, and if you're cool, like, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah. You're, as long as you're chill. I think that was the biggest thing. Like, I don't really care about, like, the the networking part of it. As long as you're chill and mm-hmm. you can, like, add to what we have going on, I think mm-hmm. it's badass. That, yeah. Like, I, uh, I try carrying that mentality, you know, throughout, especially in Smash, because, like, that's my main world. <laughs> but a lot of that i i kind of learned from ching like i watched ching do that shit and i liked how you brought everything together you know mm-hmm. so that's why i'm like oh guys come over to my fucking house yeah big ass mattress and do this dumb shit together you know mm-hmm. dude yeah right isn't that sick uh-huh. like, i would have 24 hour streams i would get people coming over like mm-hmm. dude shaman has been to my house i wow. has been to my house yeah. what um a lot of my mm-hmm. friends have been to my house like mm-hmm. you know andrew you know andrew yeah andrew's like, a homie andrew's been to yeah. my house uh, this guy named Chop Cheese been to my house. Yeah, like yeah. I was just like, if you want to come over to my house, like come. Yeah, like, yeah I don't yeah, care. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Damn, I that's trust crazy. you. You know, yeah. I trust you. I feel like I'm getting a two. I'm getting like a two layered episode of a podcast here because I'm learning so much about AJ uh-huh. too. Like I didn't even know that was the. Because I mean, honestly, without without that attitude like aj and i aren't even here doing this fucking podcast yeah, right now yeah. one time like he was just like hey he's like you're in socal i was like yeah he's like bro come over mm-hmm. i was like yeah. all right fuck it partially well, I, I trust yeah. you partially <laughs> though i will say i also that also carries from smash like i i that weird mentality of just letting a stranger over mm-hmm. i learned that mm-hmm. from smash brothers like because mm-hmm. you you didn't have netflix <laughs> at yeah. a time and you said like yeah i had to go on facebook or some shit or some forum like hey i live in Fucking so this city in SoCal, come over and yeah. play melee, mm-hmm. and that's I would let strangers yeah, yeah. over, I, and then thankfully like most of them were cool, and then if they weren't cool, I just wouldn't see them a, a next time, you know. Mm-hmm. But I feel like I still maintain that mentality. Like Galusi, I don't know. Well, like other homies, like I just let them sleep over. Mm-hmm. And I haven't told Joe. I was like, oh, by the way. We haven't met them yet, but they're gonna sleep at my house. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, "What the <laughs> fuck? You're like a stranger." Yeah, I was like, "Yeah, he's yeah. cool." Yeah. And, you know, we know mm-hmm. you know each other through like Twitch. You know. Uh, Mm-hmm. But yeah that whole mentality kind of stemmed from that i think mm-hmm. dude it's all funny you say that because you remember the pj i mentioned earlier he plays falco too mm-hmm. the first like i met him at a high school tournament that i went because we had tournaments in my high school that we ran oh shit. and uh um he was in college and then he was like uh he was talking to me like at the literally the first day i met him and he was like Hey man, like I'm actually going up to a tournament and at this college, you want to come with me? And I was like, Oh hell yeah, I do. Mm-hmm. And then like last year he was talking to me. He's like, yeah, bro, you were like 16. I was like 19. I asked you if you wanted to ride and you said, yeah. And then I was like, damn, I got this kid in my car. <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell is this yeah. kid? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and our, you know we're best friends yeah. Yeah, yeah, awesome. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah yeah i was about to say that some of the, some of the most unlikely connections you know come from that shit like mm-hmm. i think that's that's that shit's super dope like i'm definitely trying to like i think it's you know especially like it's been really good for me too like being in the twitch community because i'm definitely more of like an introverted type of person mm-hmm. so it's like it's been cool to like expand and like see all these different types of people and like perspectives and shit you know like yeah i think it's a uh, i think it's really interesting um you know, you're kind of mentioning um, sort of like the, I guess, you know, we were talking about content on like your YouTube and stuff like that. I'm kind of curious, like, do you have a process for coming up with ideas of like how you're going to do the next challenge for Cuphead kind of thing? Or is it just like you're just laying in your bed one day and then it's like, yes, OK, I have the next idea. Like, how does that process sort of look like? Dude, mostly like that, but mostly at work. I just mm-hmm. sit at work. I have a journal and I just write all day. But dude, the funniest thing. All right, so I I did the I I, I steal it from people a lot. I'll admit it. Oh yeah, that's I, normal. I, I yeah, twist. I was about to say we all do. Yeah, but, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, I made the Cuphead feet video, okay? And I was like, dude, this shit, bang! Mm-hmm. This is my ticket to stardom, bro. Like hundred views. And I was like, what? <laughs> and then I see some guy post like, I beat Cuphead with the lobber, like 500k views. Shh, like, shh, don't want to, don't want to 
I want to roast the guy like this. Mm-hmm. Shitty editing, mm-hmm. shitty mic, yeah. <laughs> thumbnail. Come on, shit, this dude. Man, fucking, your on. shoes whack, your style's <laughs> whack. It's fucking wacky shit. Yeah, yeah I'm not gonna wacky. show this dude. Yeah. I can do that. What the? Uh-huh. I can do like ten minutes. Yeah. I, I I beat the game with twist up in an hour. Mm-hmm. Uploaded it. Boom, banger. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh fuck, dude. This is stupid. Yeah. <laughs> it's that easy, huh? Um, it's that easy. But yeah. now nowadays, like. I used to be like, especially with uh, TikTok and YouTube, I was I have a pretty one set track mind where it's like I can only upload this or else I'm gonna fall off. But now, like, uh, I'm I, I've been listening to a lot of books and I've kind of like I like uh I like the okay okay I'm gonna I'm gonna hit you with the Kung Fu Panda wisdom, bro. Okay, 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 okay. bro. I, I saw a Twitter post recently that really resonated with me, and they and he was like. Uh, Master Ugwe actually chose Poe not because he was the chosen one, but just to prove that warriors are made, not mm. like born, you know. So oh, he's yeah, yeah, yeah. made into it. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, so yeah. it it went with Master Ugwe's like play it by like play it by ear, you know, like like mm-hmm. day by day. Yeah. And that's and then he sees Poe and like he's doing good. He just goes, ooh, like let's see how this develops. Mm-hmm. You yeah, know, yeah, like yeah, let's yeah, yeah. let's see how this grows. Yeah. And so now, because I'm trying to make more than just Cuphead videos. So I uploaded a piece of tower video. I was like, fuck it. Let's just see what happens. Let's, uh-huh. yeah, let's yeah. play it day by day. Let's see what I can make. And yeah. if it pops, it pops. Why mm-hmm. the hell not? You know, yeah. my, my views aren't going to go anywhere. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I love that mentality, honestly. I, do, I fucking love that mentality. I, love, yeah. I also love how like it's, you know, it was a really beautifully put, but that's from fucking Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda <laughs> yeah. I was about to say, yeah, man. Those fucking, those DreamWorks movies, man. They had, they'd be giving you the wisdom in the most random places. Uh-huh. Yeah. Dude, bro. They do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But, oh wait, uh, dude. Can I can I do a quick show and can I do a quick show and tell real quick? Please do. Yeah, yeah. Dude, you guys are gonna freak out when you see what I what I own in my position right now. Oh shit. You guys are gonna freak out. I'm scared. Can't wait to see this. I know. Okay, what do you think it is? I have no idea. He's gonna show us like some fucking Kung Fu, some Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> I know, right? Some Kung... look at this. <laughs> do you see <laughs> the smile? Yeah, it's <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking the scariest shit I ever seen. Oh, I got, I got, I got to build this up a little bit. All right, okay, so okay, okay. you know, you, 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 did you guys watch Genesis three at all? Were you guys, did you guys watch that tournament? The, what, which one was Genesis okay. three? I might know it's, of it. It's, it's I'm, I'm, a, I'm a slippy kid, thing. so I, I only know everything okay. from like history. I like, watched. Uh, well, I, I was, I was Apex twenty fifteen start for me. All right, well. You know, you know that, you know that, you know that, that thing where Mewtwo King's getting wobbled my new Ten dude. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I watched that. I watched that. He's like about to, yeah. <laughs> bro, I own the jersey that Nintendo wore <laughs> in that, bro, and it's real, dude. It, no way. Like, I'm what? buying an end nude, bro. Oh my god! <laughs> How'd you I get own, that? I own the jersey that made Mewtwo King cry, bro. Oh my god, <laughs> dude, that's a, that's actually like legendary, like icy shit. Yeah, you know, dude, like I was about to say, that's like yeah. some fucking like. Mm-hmm. I know that, like everybody knows the video. I'm, I'm just going, uh, just, just, just going like, like, oh fuck. And he played dude, the I'm, Yakuza I'm, Zero song. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so how'd you get that? Yeah, like yeah. in my eyes, it's in my you know, you see those fucking movies where like. A kid's there in like the in the dugout, and like he's like, "Hey, kid, catch!" <laughs> he gives him like a fucking jersey yeah, and gives yeah. him his shoes the and shit. Or yeah, but like, how the fuck did you get his jersey, dude? I was in the Icy's Discord, and one day I just see him post, "Hey, I'm cleaning out my closet. You want to buy a jersey?" And I was like, "Oh shit!" Like, and then I was with my friend Alex, and I was like, "Dude, he's selling jerseys. Let's see if he has this one from this specific video." Mm-hmm. And then he sends me the list of what he has, and he has this one. And, and dude, I was like, I want that one. He goes, ooh, the retro one. <laughs> and, and I was like, yes, sir. And he's like, why do you want it? And I was like, I'm a big fan, bro. <laughs> I, lo- I love Nintendo, dude. You know yeah. what I mean? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Yo, by the way, he's killing it. He's a, he's, I think he's like a lead something for the chess.com. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I saw yeah. that fucking mm-hmm. thing. Because, I, yeah, I saw him at the chess boxing thing. He mm-hmm. was like, I don't know. He was like running around and stuff. Mm-hmm. It always struck me as like a really, really smart guy. Like mm-hmm. I never, I he was like before my times so where I never got to watch him play. Did you ever like get any cool icy strip from him, or do you just like enjoy watching him play? <laughs> I, I I just bought it. Yeah, he's bought his jersey. Yeah, I I fuck with him, but this I've only watched him back when I didn't really like icy because he's wobbled. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 wobbling is cool and all, but now with like slug and stuff like mm-hmm. that coming up. He's the only like notable ices I can think of on off top, but There's no army. wobbling, bro, and he looks sick playing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. dude, he fucking is. It, was it just one time he beat Zane, or is it a? 
Oh, yeah, I don't remember. Yeah, <laughs> but, boy, Choke Nader beat mm-hmm. Zane. <laughs> what? In choke? 20, yeah, really? Choke beat him with ICs, bro. Yeah, really. This is like before. Oh, okay, I was about to say. Damn. Wait, no, that's not that's how long ago though. Yeah, he was still like, say, that's yeah. still like he's still he's still, he's still pretty good. Yeah, he's shit. still Zane yeah. at that point, right? Yeah. yeah, but yeah, this is sort of my last little portion of my little question here, and then we can sort of just start shooting the shit. But I'm kind of curious, like you know, you were you were talking about, um, you know, your 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 sort of outlook on content like the stuff you're doing now like you know with the pizza tower and all this like do you have any sort of upcoming plans that you feel like you're really excited about that you that you want to share with or you're just kind of like taking it you're just taking it day by day and seeing what interests you day by day yeah i figure yeah. i'll make a banger eventually mm-hmm. hey, I mean, the, next course, video, I'm, the next video coming out it's gonna be a banger i tell oh, you yeah. what like that's okay. the next video i'm excited for bro oh shit this okay. next one coming out dude it's gonna hit uh-huh. it's gonna it's gonna blow me up. Oh right? shit! I love that. I was about, to, hey man, you might need to drop the YouTube, bro. Uh-huh. Somebody drop the YouTube because one million uh, views, yeah, one yeah. ten million views. I, I believe views. that shit. I believe need, that shit. Million. We need, we need to plug our, we need to pl- plug our homies around uh-huh. here. I don't see that shit. Cuphead forever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it's a, it's a Cuphead video. Beat of the game with convergence, baby. Oh, dude. Okay. You want to hear my master plan? Actually, I do have a plan. Okay. okay. Good. All good. right. All right. Here, hear this plan. Hear this plan. So, so I I saw a Cuphead tearless video. And I, bro, I hate I I'm roasting people, but no, uh, I, I like it. I like it. I like he it. just he just let it rip. He had no cuphead videos on his channel. He had nothing. He's made a cuphead choose video for one and got a million views. Wow. And that's, like, and that's his first video. And I was like, what the fuck does this guy know about cuphead? This guy's <laughs> stupid, bro. Like he doesn't know anything. He has he has no no what's the word like no mm-hmm. proof. Yeah. No, uh, mm-hmm. what, what's it like when you have like a bunch of medals, like a war veteran? Yeah, like, uh, you got no experience. You, don't have, you, don't have, you know, yeah, you, don't you don't have your, you haven't put your time in. Yeah, yeah, you got your yeah, you know the time in, bro. Yeah. And so I was like, I can do way better. So I'm gonna mm-hmm. beat. I'm gonna make a video of me being the being the game with every single weapon, and then I'm gonna t- I'm gonna make a cuphead video. Okay, imagine this: the title, I beat Cuphead with every weapon to answer this one question in the thumbnail. Mugman hitting the shrug. <laughs> What is the best weapon, dude? I love that. Isn't he... I love that. Mm-hmm. That's amazing. I've been, I've been imagining this for like yeah. months now uh-huh. in my head, and I can't wait to make it. Oh uh-huh. man, that's amazing. Do you do you edit all your own stuff too, or is it? Mm. Wow. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this Ching is just so looking, Yeah, he's just just Matt Jack of all trades. Uh-huh. Just the content man, dude. Because oh. like I, I don't know. I had some. I used to have someone edit for me. Like just like my Twitch stuff and no BM, I just didn't like any of it. Just because mm. it's like if I don't have total control over what's happening, I don't like it. Yeah. Like if I didn't make it, because then I'm watching someone else's video and then it's yeah, like, yeah. oh. No, I see. I like that mindset, but it's like at the same time, like it's hard. the concept of like of work, wanting to clone myself and yeah. you know, you know, trying to do that shit is like you know that's not possible. So, mm-hmm. but like mm. the fact that you're able to do it is fucking crazy. I was about know? to say because that that's the 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 thing that really speaks to is like the work ethic because. I I also love the idea of like having a video completely like you know in my like uh control or whatever you want to call it but I'm also like I don't want to do that shit. Uh-huh. <laughs> so yeah. it's like yeah so like I big big ups to you for real for like buckling down and like getting that shit done like you're you're a literal one man army like that shit's tight. <laughs> yeah, I'm 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 uh, juggernauting it right now. Yeah. I can yeah. I can't think of having it any other way though. Mm-hmm. I mean I, I mean I like the, I love the process. Mhm. It's been cool. Like I, he, uh, sometimes you do like a Discord thing where you're like, you're editing or some shit, and the homies pull up just like to distract you. <laughs> yeah, because I'm like, I gotta edit. Yeah. So I hop into Discord, stream it. Mm-hmm. That way, I have to edit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel that. Like that. It's like an accountability kind of thing. Yeah, think- but lately I've been a uh, ebook pilled, so that makes it even better. Mm-hmm. And I've been uh, kind of into myself, not to myself, but like just enjoying my own company. Yeah. So it's, I just been hell alone all the time, just in my room. Mm-hmm. Yeah. just going going bonkers you know mm-hmm. I'm a, i feel like i'm a, a youtube mad scientist sometimes uh-huh. just like i have like <laughs> i have a whole journal cooking. of notes yeah <laughs> i'm cooking i'm cooking Dude, the, i, 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 lo- I fucking love bro. this shit i'm yeah. telling you i'm telling you ching shit with all these fucking madman ideas and shit mm-hmm. <laughs> i was about to bro. Gonna blow like blow yeah i was about, i need to start talking to ching for real bro i need to start getting some of the because i'm trying yeah i'm trying to do that shit too like i think uh youtube is definitely where it's at in terms of like growth and stuff because you see all these like content creators talking about it too it's like yeah streaming on twitch is not the way to like pop off like mm. just streaming yeah, on twitch definitely is definitely not, not definitely enough nice. like you cannot do that shit like, discover bodies out there yeah like you got to do something else first and then you can kind of leverage that into twitch mm. but 
I think that's really impressive that you're like able to do that shit and like because you're yeah, like and I'm sure once you hit that that one mil like that's gonna feel yeah. so fucking mm-hmm. that's gonna feel so good. I feel like though I'm not real until 100k subscribers. Mm-hmm. I think I think I'm at 15k. It's still nothing. I don't know. It's yeah. like nothing mm-hmm. compared to some people out there. That's nothing. Oh yeah, for sure. Like, for I sure. think I think once I hit well, I mean actually the same thing when I was, I was like once I hit 10k, it's gonna look real. Mm-hmm. And it doesn't look real. I can get 100k. Yeah. I can get a, a 10k. <laughs> I can get a 100k now. I can. I can do anything. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I, I'm cheering. I'm cheering you. I was about to say, and I think that's a good thing too. Like as long as you can, you know, harness that energy in the right way, right? Because sometimes it's like some people are like, "Fuck, it's never gonna be enough." But if like, like some people can channel that and be like, "Yeah, like use that to as like motivation kind of thing," mm-hmm. while it doesn't, yeah, like, completely consume you. But your man, your mindset on it seems pretty good. Like it seems like you enjoyed, like you do what you enjoy, and then like the numbers are a product of that but it's not like about the numbers necessarily yeah that's that's the magic of the full-time job yeah thank god i don't care mm-hmm. <laughs> i don't care what happens it's yeah. not my main source of income yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That's, that's awesome i love that mm-hmm. did you ever try that out as a full-time thing or you come uh, with... if i made if i made over 100k a year i would mm-hmm. that's the goal if i make if i make six figures a year i will do it full-time mm-hmm. yeah that's until a... then nah. mm-hmm. all right next next year we'll, we'll... Make the push. We'll link, link back <laughs> yeah, up, and then we'll see other progress. Yeah, yeah like. see what happens. Yeah. yeah, I think that. Yeah, it's just I, I, I content doing content full time is probably so stressful. Especially you, you're you know doing the streaming thing for a while. Like, yeah. terrible. That, that seems so yeah. stressful. Like fucking shit. I don't know. <laughs> like, yeah, it's 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 so easy to to get. Like, wait. So how? Sorry. Like, I want to uh, refresh because like, how long have you been doing the YouTube for? Like, when did you start making YouTube videos? Shoot. Recent, right? It's only been like. Uh, I've been making YouTube videos for like two years now, I think. Mm-hmm. Just like mostly just on my stream, and then uh, I started making them of games like a year ago, mm-hmm. and yeah. then yeah, I started off with something called the Daily Dub, where I got a Fall Guys dub every day, yeah. and I would just uh, I would just talk over it, yeah, like just do commentary. Because I was like, mm-hmm. I'm gonna be one of those gameplay commentary channels. Yeah, oh, yeah, I want to yeah. talk about the real issues, mm-hmm. and then yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then i started gaming more <laughs> yeah. which i still think i do like i but instead of commentating like like about like stuff that i want to talk about i don't care like uh i had a video talking about how mcdoubles like equal inflation because mcdouble prices are going up <laughs> stuff yeah and then now i just explain the game i'm playing mm-hmm. uh-huh. yeah man i think that's yeah i think that's that there's something definitely beautiful about that shit just like starting the youtube up and just like getting it to build up from there like we definitely especially you know with the podcast shit going too we're definitely going to need to be hitting ching mm-hmm. up and yeah getting some pointers on this shit because that's definitely mad impressive i did not even know that you had it like that but so, yeah anything you want because i need i need to learn i've been trying mm-hmm. to i've been trying to i listen to like uh you're, you're listening like what's his name like lex friedman lex friedman he's mm-hmm. a podcaster right, right. Mm-hmm. No. he just like interviews people and but he he did it with mr beast and Mr. Beast was like, yeah, dude, I just want to be surrounded by amazing people. Sometimes I just pull my phone, man. I call someone, say, teach me one thing now. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> shit, okay. Oh, well. <laughs> I got to do that. Yeah. And so, like, uh, yeah. I, like I, any anyone that can, like, mm. I, I don't mean it like this, but, like, anyone that can give me, like, some kind of, like, like knowledge or value, I'll mm. hit them up. Like, yeah. yeah, I'd be like, yeah. like, for any, like, there's this, you know, you guys know Simply, the, the yeah, speed of course, of course. yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, uh, Cake and I smoked a blunt with him at TwitchCon. Wow. And I met this guy named Gleason, who's this thumbnail guy. And I was like, hey, yo, like, I need help with my thumbnails. Like, what's up? Can you, like, can we get in a call or something? He got a call and he showed me the ropes for thumbnails. Dude. And then man. after I talked to him, I felt like my thumbnails actually, like, dude, he, it was the craziest thing. Like, I talked to him at a TwitchCon mm-hmm. and I was like, so you do his thumbnails, yeah? And he was like, uh, and this is when, like, my Cuphead video was at 100K views. And I was like, oh, I have, like, this video, like, it's doing good. But, like, let me show me, let me show you the thumbnail. Like, just say one thing that I can improve. And he, he looks at it and like, so it has the word pain in the thumbnail, okay? But it's white. And he was like, bro, just make that pain red because red is bad. And I was like, it's that <laughs> easy. It, yeah. it made too much sense, bro. Yeah. It, I mean, that's what I said. It doesn't make sense. Too much sense. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're actually correct about that. I think that's such an interesting, like, I, I, I love talking about this shit too. You know, AJ always talks about how he loves talking shop and shit. And like, mm-hmm. I think this is really dope because... You know, especially as someone who's like recently sort of got into content myself. Like I started streaming in like twenty twenty one or whenever. Like it's really recent. Um, I, I think I think that was definitely my biggest misconception about it was that like 
you just had these people who were just on top and they were just there because they were like super entertaining. And like, that's only like a part of it in a sense where it's like, there's so many different angles to this shit. Like you have, you can have your own niche. You can have like crazy on point thumbnail game, like production quality. Like, there's so much stuff that goes into it. And I definitely think that's really cool that we get to like talk about this shit where it's like, you know, we're, we're sort of getting into the meat and potatoes because i definitely think that's a big misconception a lot of people who don't know about content yeah yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah and like i i want to be that guy too like i want to i want to give value to other people also like i if you have any questions come to me yeah mm -hmm. like i i love i i even just answer your questions it helps like i know it's cheesy but it definitely helps me learn because i got to think about it and i got to answer it yeah yeah, yeah. and then yeah. it's like it's like you know you're studying you know mm -hmm. it's, it's literally like you're studying you gotta talk mm -hmm. about it more and then yeah. I talk about stuff because I talk all the time. I love talking to people. Yeah, yeah. I cannot stop. Mm -hmm. But and then yeah, and then we get closer too. If you ask me questions, absolutely. Like, hey, together, you know. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think it's super super. Because I was yeah, I was about to, like I'm. I was just telling Adrian when you were going to get the the jersey. Like I'm. It's cool that it's like I've gotten to actually meet you because we've seen each other in the AJ's chat a bunch of times and shit. Like so and so, but this is like cool actually getting to talk now and shit. Like it's been a it's been a dope ass time. Yeah, I'm, awesome. I'm, I'm really happy we did this podcast. Yeah, well, it's really cool because like, me. yeah, of course, of course. <clears throat> and I appreciate. I never said it again, but I appreciate you pulling up. Yeah, same. The DJ said <laughs> at Genesis, you didn't have Dude. to because like you you fucking got off work or some shit early and then you drove fucking into San Jose. Damn, oh, that mm -hmm. shit's far. But. That's that's well, true homie ship right there. Well, think about it, bro. Like it's your big moment. I had to be there, and then also it was so sick being there. Like that's. Literally, that's like a like I met you on Twitch, and now that's a core memory. Yeah, yeah, I'll be yeah, honest, yeah, yeah. bro. It was so sick being there. I was, I feel like I was, I was, I was working the crowd a little bit in the beginning. Mm. Definitely got the people going. Yeah, I saw and that then, show. Awesome. Dude, he was like, dude, just being there too. Yeah. It was sick being yeah, there. Yeah. Like, dude, we. I had the weirdest thing happen. Okay, so my friend his tags Nanashi, and he lives in Arizona. And then we, there's just like, just like look, I don't I forget. It's like a bench, like a bench that moves around. And I, I parked there with my friend Bryce. And I was, Let's just talk to anyone who walks over here. And yeah. like people were just coming and going all day. I'm at hell of heads. I'm mm -hmm. at a lot of heads. But they, I, I go to this guy. And he's like, oh, yeah, I'm from Arizona. I'm like, oh, bro, you know Nanashi? He's like, yeah, dude. Nanashi's I'm his a bracket homie. demon. And oh. I was like, oh, fuck, dude. And so I yeah. had him in Discord. I'm like, dude, I'm with Jeremy. Do you know this guy? And he was <laughs> like, dude, how would you meet Jeremy? And I was like, like dude, he guy. just walked yeah. by me. <laughs> and I said, what's up? That's so funny. Yeah, small no. world. Uh -huh. Small it's, world. That's how it goes, especially in Melee. Like, you know, Genesis is one of the first big majors I went to. And I <laughs> definitely, I was like, oh, like, you know, you got people coming up to you. Cause like I was streaming Melee for a while before that. And I was like, oh, hey. And I'm like, oh, shoot, it's you. Like, you know, mm -hmm. I get to meet all the homies. Like, it's such a, such a dope ass experience. Like, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. But um, yeah, I mean, that's all I got for the question portion. That's all I have yeah. too. Yeah. Unless there's Again, anything else you want to talk about. Yeah. No, I think Dude, I, not, I can't get over that Genesis 9 party. <laughs> I want to talk about that more. That was, like yeah, you were yeah. saying, dude, you were saying the community, like, people just walk up to you. Mm -hmm. That's why I want to play Melee again. That's why I was like, uh -huh. I have to play. Like, after, yeah. after Genesis 9 came through, I was like, dude, there's no way I could not play. Mm -hmm. no. Dude. And I told I told myself, dude, if I make it to Genesis 10, I'll buy a FOB. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. They're, they're fob pretty affordable up. now. You could just, I was about know. to say, I, I, I hard. Mine, fine now. Dude, mine was pretty cheap. I, I saw the weirdest thing today, bro. $99 fobs. Can you fucking believe it? Yeah, this yeah, is, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow, it's not, I don't think it's just weird. I, I think uh, that's becoming the norm. That's why it, they're definitely no going way. down. Yeah, it's yeah, going yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. It's getting, getting down. And also, like, it's, it's more available. Cheaper. It's not like a yeah. other <laughs> proprietary stuff. I'm mm -hmm. not going to say anything. Yeah. Names. <laughs> but <laughs> I, I like the colors, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, he's selling the board for 65 bucks, and I kind of just want to buy it because yeah. I have a bunch of, like, controllers I don't give a fuck about. Just, you know, Take it out. Slap, yeah, that, yeah. slap that sucker. Yeah, slap right? it on, bro. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. I got that shit for like a little over a hundred, I would say. Yeah. And this was like a year you ago, got a maybe. Pop for a hundred? Yeah, like a little over a hundred. I'm telling you. Yeah. I'm telling you. They're, yeah. Like, it's a. Uh, mm -hmm. It's very affordable. And this was like a year or, or, or two years ago. It's not like a year and a half ago yeah, or something. They're yeah. pumping them out now. Mm -hmm. Since we were just charging out the ass for what? Yeah, mm -hmm. I was about to say like you really <laughs> yeah. do not. And I, I love my. I still use that shit to this day. Like I, I love that thing. So I just got. I got an OEM. Mm -hmm. I'm OEM dub. Are you yeah. going to any other majors this year? I want to. We should go. I want to. So I'm trying bad. to pull up to some. Yeah. If you let me know, anyone, any of you want to. I mean, main stage. I think I'm going for sure, mm -hmm. like 100. percent But outside of that, what's that? Know. Where is uh, that? What's in uh, SoCal? SoCal. If you need a spot, I got Dude. you. I got what you. It? It's in December. 
I can hell and make that. Yeah. yeah. And it, main stage, main stage gang. Main stage is the first place I met AJ in person. Yeah. Yeah. That was That's sick. Yeah. I went to any other other <laughs> stuff though, like even outside of melee. Did, did you ever go to Twitch? You did go to Twitch on last year. Did yeah. You still go to, like, what, you yeah. Can, what do you feel? About I don't that? know. if I'm gonna go this year. I yeah, don't know. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I kind of. <laughs> I, I I probably it's in Vegas, which is cool. Oh uh, yeah. But That's I already dope. had a Vegas trip planned for April. Mm. And so it's like damn. For Evo or no? Mm. Just some No, no, it, yeah, Evo's in August. August. Okay. I, I'm, yeah, I'm going to Evo this year. <laughs> yeah. Dude, it yeah. also sucks that my job, I work at like a canning company. Yeah. And so like uh I think it's from July until October. It's called Fresh Pack. And it's where just tomatoes are coming in by like, I think it's like <laughs> 6 million pounds of tomatoes a day or something. Yeah. And so oh, wow. I, have to, I have to work six days a week mm-hmm. there on a Saturday. So I don't know how plausible it is for me to yeah. get work off. That's the yeah. problem. I feel- Which that's what I'm saying. It might be an excuse not to go. I, yeah. I still want to go, but like I was saying, I kind of want to prioritize other events. Yeah, right of now. course. Like, of course. Yeah, like, of course. dude, I, I've only, the only melee major I've ever been to is Evo. And which isn't even like a miss. Oh, that was fun as fuck. Yeah. But in Genesis, I go to Genesis mm-hmm. every year. Those are fucking good ones, though. Like, yeah. If there's any mm-hmm. to go to, Evo's tight. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real, yeah, pretty yeah, real. Yeah, pretty yeah. real. Those so are like the biggest, else. the biggest of the big. <clears throat> yeah. oh, what, what was your experience with TwitchCon like? Actually, I, 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 I feel like I, I hear mixed reviews about TwitchCon like all the time. What was, what was that like? Oh, I had an awesome time, bro. Oh, yeah. all the homies from yeah, yeah. chat and stuff like that. We all mm-hmm. we had, had an Airbnb. Airbnb of like fifteen of us. Oh wow, we were just yeah. crammed in there, dude. We were just smoking cigarettes, yeah. <laughs> drinking beer, yeah. smoking. We, we were dude. Just we were just walking it. around, dude. Uh, oh my god, fucking! I don't know if I should say this here. <laughs> Feel free to like not say it. <laughs> I, no, hey. it's, not, it's not bad. Okay, uh, okay. No, I won't say it. I won't say it. <laughs> no, 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 you it. can you can say it. It's, if it, it, it has if, to be, okay, all I'm gonna else. say is, bro, someone had someone had sticky hands in the merch shop. That's all I'm gonna say, bro. Someone, okay. oh, someone's sure. hands were a little sticky in the merch Wait, shop. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay, I, you don't need to say names. <laughs> your boy collected everything. Oh, 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 <laughs> you're giving to yourself, dog. Somebody had sticky what are you hands. Doing? <laughs> I love that. Uh, That's tight though. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, they had these golden edition pins. I got golden OS frog. Dude, these were sold out. Wow. Uh, <laughs> dude, I had this. Dude, and then uh, I got this pen, bro. The Twitch pen. Damn. This goes hard. Oh, dude, you wanna, huh? That thing is. Want to know some weird stuff about this pen? The weird. I had the yeah, weirdest yeah. experience. Like, all right, this is like three weeks ago. I took a lot of shrooms. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna be straight up. Yeah, I took yeah. a lot of shrooms, uh-huh. and I had I had this journal and this right here. And I was kind of like, I, I was, I was good. Like it was really a test of my, it was a real test of my mental fortitude. I tell you what, <laughs> but I was chilling and I was kind of, I was kind of just like basing my, like locked down on the journal. This, I was getting really sentimental mm-hmm. and I was like, this shit means a lot to me, Twitch. And then all these stickers on there, like I was looking at rat doodle sticker. Mm-hmm. I was yeah. tearing up, bro. Like my mm-hmm. sticker got Ludwig mm-hmm. sticker. Yeah. Base God, of course, mm-hmm. Bugman and coots and then cricket. <laughs> mm-hmm. I was getting sentimental, bro. I was like, damn. So now this is my favorite pen in the world. Uh, yeah. I can't yeah. imagine like you, you writing and like smoke is coming. Here. <laughs> I'm like, you know, like, oh, bro, you want to yeah. you want to see what I wrote when I was <laughs> dude? It's the dumbest shit. Let me see this shit. I put I put two eighteen p.m. did shrooms. Four p.m. did shrooms. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I put. Nice. <laughs> He's getting, getting sentimental. Your captain's log. Uh, <laughs> captain's log. <laughs> Oh man, that's yeah. so cool. would recommend doing good. doing a fuck ton of shrooms. Mm-hmm. Would yeah. would definitely recommend, bro. Would recommend. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's Dude, that sounds, that sounds fun as hell. That. Yeah, I've never Dude. gotten into that. Man, I kind of had such a bad habit. Do at Genesis. I smoked so fucking much. Oh yeah, <laughs> I came <laughs> back from Genesis and did my. I had high blood pressure. <laughs> Damn. Oh, like, oh shoot! I, Damn. I I was fucking up. Mm-hmm. Damn. Dude, every every Genesis I've been to, I get degenerate. Mm-hmm. I did acid at Genesis three, four, and five. Damn. And I, I I just popped LSD, bro, and went to the venue, dude. And I remember my friend Russell was playing Marth. Dude, what the fuck do you play Marth, bro? Marth is such a stupid character. <laughs> Marth is so degenerate, dude. I hate all Marth players. They're all degenerate. <laughs> and then when I walked away, my friend told me these two guys next to Russell were doing Marth dittos, and he was like. Dude, why was he talking to us like that? <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh, yeah, shit, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad, bro. Oh, and the yeah. venue would be 24 hours, so I'd be there until mm-hmm. like 9 a.m. just gaming hard. Yeah, just, just nonstop. Wait, Whack. 9 a.m., so all night? And then all hit night, 9 a.m. morning? Oh, all damn. night. Damn. We just, we just play just, Melee. Just yeah. gaming. I tried doing that shit. 
over at Genesis, I was drinking at a fucking goat house, and I walked down, like drunkenly, back to the venue <laughs> to play melee. And I would pass out at like five. Like, oh, okay, this is too much. <laughs> Dude, it's yeah. different. We're we're old now. I know, I know. We're old. Even, Actually, it's not too different. Maybe just some acid, you know. Uh, <laughs> uh-huh. That gives you <laughs> Again, that gives you, know? you the hidden energy. Uh-huh. Definitely just, like, does. How does that it's, affect your gameplay, bro? Do you feel like you play better or worse? <laughs> Dude, oh, I got another dude. I, I have so much melee to talk about because I've been grinding it. So when I did the fuck ton of shrooms, okay, I had the weirdest thing. So like, I read this. I read this book by Breathe by uh, you know, you know Gracie Jiu Jitsu. Mm. No, it's like uh, just it's it's Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, mm-hmm. but Gracie is OG. But they someone like literally trademarked the name Gracie, so they made Brazilian Jiu Jitsu to break off of it. Okay, but it was about Hicks and Gracie, and he's like the one of the best Jiu Jitsu pr- practitioners. And he had a thing where he like, dude, this book was badass. Like he was really like in a like, the, like basically like what the, what happened was the Gracies just wanted to make a clan of jujitsu fighters, so they just went in bed with a fuck ton of women and just made a clan of jujitsu fight. Like it has many kids as they could. Wow. And so they just had a clan of jujitsus. And so he was like, the the part of being a Gracie is when you're called upon, you must be ready to fight. Like it, <laughs> it, it, like you're, like you're not a coward as long as you're ready to fight. Mm. And then, dude, I was uh. I was, I was, I took a lot of shrooms, okay? And we we're listening to hip hop, and I was watching my friends Louise and Alex play Smash. And the whole time, bro, I was sitting there like, if I'm called upon, I will, I'm ready to fight. <laughs> my ICs are ready. I, I, I was like, I was sitting there, like, I'm, like yeah. I was watching them play, and I was like, I'm ready, bro. If mm. I'm, I'm in this, like, I'm, I'm a warrior. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a warrior. Yeah, if I'm called upon, I will throw down right now. And they're like, are you want, you want to play? And I was like, I knew this time would come, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I locked in. I was, I was <laughs> beaten for this. this. I locked yeah. in. I, feel, I actually feel like a warrior. It was yeah, sick. you're fucking gaming. <laughs> I can I just imagine Ching sure. there, like in a fucking, like with, like, you know, like a black belt on and like fucking. <laughs> what do you call those? Like <laughs> the, 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 the judo outfit yeah, and shit? He's like, he's on. ready. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm not scared. I, yeah. I, 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 I've been ready to fight. Win or lose, I'm ready to fight. I'm fucking fighting. Yeah. That's so funny. I kind of like that mentality. It was sick. It was that That feeling was sick. Mm-hmm. We're just like I'm. I'm confident. Yeah. Even if I lose, I'm good. Mm-hmm. I'm. I'm here to. I'm, I'm here to fight. It. I'm yeah. not scared. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just, yeah you just can't do shrooms that often. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you, can't, <laughs> you can't. You can't. You can't feel like that all the time. But it's nice because you got to carry those lessons over to your sober self. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I mean, I have a homie. Every bracket he goes to, like it, a local, not a major. He's like, I need. I, I'm gonna just take some shrooms. I'm gonna enter my bracket, and he does really, <laughs> he does really off. well. I'm like, yeah. oh fuck. That's the key all huh? along. I've been seeking, fucking up. Yeah. Dude, well, um, I don't know if you want to get into psychedelic talk. I'm hella down. I yeah. do a lot of psych I used to do a lot of psychedelics, but so there's the you, you guys know you guys know about the flow state where it's yeah. like, you know, everything's blocked yeah, yeah, out yeah, yeah, what yeah. you're focused on. Mm-hmm. What shrooms does is it definitely enhances that flow state. Cause I've been trying to I've been researching the flow state because I really like that state of mind where you're yeah. just in it, like nothing around you even matters. Like someone can talk to you and you're not paying attention, you know. Like you're just in, you're basically, it's like basically like meditation, like in a very Zen state where it's just you and you're locked in on the game or you're locked in like, like pro basketball players. Like they have to, they have yeah. to do it in like a, you know, stadium of people just yelling well, at you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you gotta that. be able to zone it all out. And what, yeah. Shrooms definitely, uh, like locks you into that flow state okay, okay. no matter what you're focusing on. Wow. Cause I don't know if I, if I experience flow state, I feel like I experience flow state while I'm, on stream talking and shit mm-hmm. we're like i'm not yeah. even like i'm not even thinking about the fucking game but like for some reason it's doing my hands are just doing it yeah you're just i didn't gone. even say anything like i didn't think about any of those things that just happened mm-hmm. you're just yeah, like moving that's the flow state yeah yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. i'm constantly just like pulling that out when i'm streaming yeah i feel that i feel like definitely feel like there's different degrees too because like you were mentioning about the sports stuff like you know i play i played soccer in uh in college like i was a i was like a college athlete and like that's definitely a thing where you have like people yelling at you and like talking shit and like doing all this and you just got to be able to like block it all out and like get in that state of mind where it's like this is the this is what i'm fucking doing and nothing else matters and like it's definitely the same way with melee too like in bracket you definitely gotta like when you hit flow state in bracket that shit feels so good you get a fat dub you're like oh my gosh mm-hmm. i was like the hard part is maintaining that though do you feel like when you're when you're doing shrooms do you feel like you're that's like how you just are like throughout or do you feel like you kind of come in and out because that's definitely the thing about flow state is it's easy to come out of i can come in and out yeah definitely mm-hmm. come in and out did i remember uh um uh, 
Uh, this is the this is the first time I've done a lot. I did like five grams of shrooms. I went all I went balls deep. Usually you take like three like three like three point five grams, you know. So you know I topped it off. I'll say that. Mm-hmm. But my friend had a bunch of these little pellets that you shoot have a slingshot, mm-hmm. and we had a, a beer can on like a like a like on a stool basically, and I was just sitting there trying to toss it in, toss it in, and like I remember this so vividly where like the can existed. And but like everything around it was blurry, like everything <laughs> around it. What? And my friend was like, "Dude, I was calling your name for like twenty minutes. Yeah. I'm just sitting there like, mm-hmm. you did like you I didn't even hear shot, that shit. Like feeling the shot, you know, like mm-hmm. seeing where it's going. Like literally everything's blurry. Or like everything's like it's like a camera, you know, like we're just focused on the main person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, bokeh, really like that. <laughs> yeah. Wow. But yeah. dude, uh, I got hella into the flow state recently because the other day, uh, you guys ever play Puzzle Bobble? Yeah, 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 dude. That's my fucking, that's my fucking game. Me and we Joe play, play that competitively. I'm, oh wow, I'm really good at Puzzle Bobble. That, also. Okay, I'm not com- I, okay. This I'm not that confident because like if I were to go and fight Kate <clears> and <throat> someone challenged me, I'd be kind of scared. Yeah. So I don't know where you're at. You know, like, I don't know where I'm at either. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, I don't know. Because I was I like, I'm good at this good. shit, and I'm scared. Like, oh, fuck, a whole other world but, uh, of people. I, we had a party at my house, uh, and there's like a lot of people there. And I'm playing Puzzle Bobble versus my friend Rhett. And literally, like, you know, like when you start doing good, people start they're like, "Oh shit!" Like, Ooh. Mm-hmm. And they start talking, they're like, "Oh fuck!" And then more people start watching. Uh-huh. And it's me and my friend Rhett. We play, we play a lot of Puzzle Bobble, uh-huh. and like we're neck and neck. And, he's, and I'm literally about to lose. And I was just, and everyone's like, "Oh fuck, she's gonna lose!" And I was like. <laughs> and I, literally just like, I literally went ham bro like nah. maximum speed like as soon as it reloaded i shot oh Bang shots shit. quarter shots like fucking shoving it in little holes uh-huh. i hit every single shot Damn. like and it was like it was nothing bro like it was no- like i was so like i remember i felt so nervous i was like dude people are watching like i'm nervous and then i was like i can win and i beat his ass and yep. i was like wow I, I I hit the flow uh, for mm. the first noticeable time. Yeah. <laughs> shit, I feel like that shit feels so good. Yeah. <laughs> you know that shit feels great when you're playing puzzle bubble and since you're on a fight stick, you just do a, a slight, slight mm-hmm. fucking move, just like just move it barely because you're like I need that slight, or it's not gonna slide in that tiny asshole. <laughs> oh, dude, I was I was so this is the joystick, okay? You know how you're saying like you're micro tapping it, yeah, 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 bro. I was there like. Boing, 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 boing. Like I was just tapping. <laughs> and I was hitting everything. Oh, That's when I was like, uh-huh. I was like, I had, I had confident in every single one of my shots. And I was like, I was like, yeah, I'm cracked. Yeah. <laughs> I'm fucking cracked. Man, that is so fucking tight. You ever yeah. play Windjammers before? Dude, yeah, we've been playing Windjammers too. Mm-hmm. Windjammers on, on your homie's arcade, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, Dude, bro, you ever play Magical Drop? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Magical Drop from Sick. I've been obsessed with Magical Drop. I don't Magical understand Drop the concept lately. of it, though. It's like you just send a bunch of mess to your fucking homies, but you're like shooting stuff. <clears throat> yeah so you can like you just grab the balls and shoot them up basically okay, okay, you okay. can like grab as many as you want and connect three yeah yeah oh wait, no actually i'm thinking about something else then never mind uh, yeah, I, was about to say, I haven't i haven't played magical yeah, drop what do you got planned for the rest of the day or the night thank you uh, day got a lot of um i got i'm trying to play my birthday party it's Ooh, march 18th when oh, uh, oh march 18th oh, my birthday's march 15th my birthday party's march 18th oh, and my friend my friend has a band and so I'm trying to do like a house show. Yeah, that'd yeah, be a lot of fun. That's awesome. So I'm having them come over, and then fucking s- I'm smoking weed tonight, baby. It's Friday. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I, 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 I kind of like I don't allow myself to do any like no drinking, no smoking until the weekend now. Okay. Mm, I feel like shit. if I if I smoke too much weed, I get really bad anxiety. Mm. Like it's just like in general, like in life, you know, even when I'm not high or anything, like really but you know it's like i could just stop smoking weed but you know pick your poison you know mm-hmm. uh, that's how i see it it's either that or i live off coffee and cigarettes which I'd, yeah, run, yeah. I'd much rather fucking do i love coffee and cigarettes you still actively smoke right now you know work yeah <laughs> no Dude. only only no 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 i don't actively do it okay it's only like... uh the last time i actually bought cigarettes was genesis I only do okay, it when I go yeah. to big stuff. Yeah, yeah. I, dude, and that was the best idea. I made so many friends just off the pack. Dude, I, got, I made friends with none. Yeah, I, I smoked with you. I smoked with you. I was like, I, like, I can't bum me off you. Dude, yeah. I, 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 I used the whole pack that night. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. I, I don't want to take them home. If yeah. I take them home, I start smoking yeah, on yeah, my yeah, own. Yeah. And that's, mm-hmm. I, I feel bad. That's dope. It's like a social thing. Yeah, but it's like, it's so bad. It's like, mm-hmm. when I worked at an off, like, an, another off, my last office job, it was like part of the culture. It's like, oh, Smoke break, like three times a you know three times a shift, you know. Fuck that, you know. I was you know I like, yeah, fuck it, and like, you guys going back. It's either yeah. that you or you didn't take a break, you know. 
Damn. So for some reason, I was like, oh, you're just, you know, you're lazy if you're not. Uh, if you're taking a break and just sitting there, you know. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, <laughs> for some reason, if you're a smokey, it's like, oh yeah, yeah, no, he's he's. You know. That's like also you remember, that's a fucking Family Guy episode where he like discovers smoking. Peter fucking discovers smoking. It's like, oh shit, mm-hmm. I can fucking go take these smoke breaks. Yeah, now. yeah. Uh, was that a fr- that was, I think that was a Friends episode too. <laughs> or, uh, Chan- Chandler, Chandler, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Chandler, yeah. and I think Rachel also had a thing where she was smoking cigarettes. Mm-hmm. Get that, get that I was, nice yeah, break I was, time. Dude, it wasn't bad for your health. Yeah. But, I, I've never, I've never um, smoked one. Respect. Don't, don't, don't smoke. Don't do it. Uh, yeah, no, yeah. I, hey, enjoy, <laughs> enjoy, enjoy Earth's riches while you can. I mean, yeah. hey, one time for the one time. But yeah. uh, you know, everything in moderation. That's yeah. probably the best thing. Yeah. Like, as long as you're not, as I see it, as long as you're not like chronically addicted to shit. Yeah. Uh, then I was about to say, like, yeah. hindering you. Everything mm-hmm. is mo- in moderation for sure. Yeah. Like right now, I'm like, dude, I need a cigarette. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. I gotta go. <laughs> that's when. It, that's when it's bad. <laughs> that's when it's fucking bad. <laughs> I'm just right. fucking hungry as shit. Yeah, but I mean, thanks, for, yeah. thanks for kicking in, man. Appreciate you, Ching. It was Dude, good to talk. Yeah, I, yeah. I will mo- 100% yeah. be hitting you up. You're in AJ's Discord, I'm assuming. So I'll definitely just add you. Actually, we're, I guess we're in a group I think I have an AJ's Discord. I don't uh, know AJ had a Discord yeah. for real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're, we're, I mean, every fucking person has yeah. their own. So like, I mute everyone's yeah. Discord. <laughs> each other. I was, we're yeah, we're in a group chat now. I'm just going to add you on Discord, bro. I'll mm. definitely be hitting you up. <laughs> The spontaneous gun. Te- teach me something now, <laughs> dude. Do it. I love talking. Yeah. I literally, I literally at work. I just, I, I, I get all my work done by noon, and I sit there listening to books. Yeah. Whoever sends me a me- if you send me a message like anyone from like 12, 8, 12 p.m. to four p.m., I'll answer instantly. I swear to God. Right, I really appreciate that, bro. Yeah, like I'll definitely be reaching out because that's you. You've dropped some some prime wisdom on us. Yeah, it's, it's like beginner knowledge, but I mean, yeah. so far it's been working. You know, mm-hmm. so. Yeah. Like any any anything i mean bigger. the other stuff is just like the details of it these are like the actual meat meat and potatoes like if you just focus on the fundamentals yeah, yeah. i think i have the fundamentals down really well i yeah, think yeah, that's yeah. it like i think so you know too. practice a kick a thousand times mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah or the fucking <laughs> eggs yeah the eggs yeah i guess i'd be, I'd be applying yeah, that to yeah. a lot of my stuff yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but no, Ching, definitely appreciate you hopping on. This is dope. Uh, you know, I, I, had a, I had a great time. I had a great time, too. It was awesome. Yeah. yeah. It was nice. nice talking to Kmart, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was dope, man. I appreciate it. Yeah, hopefully, we'll talk soon. Yeah. Uh, and whenever oh, in yeah. SoCal, pull up, man. I, I got I'm a down, place for yeah. you. Yeah. I'll probably, uh, I don't know when I'm going to be up there, yeah. but I want to go up there sometime. I want to do that. You know where I want to go? I want to go out of state. I'm tired. Yeah. I feel, yeah, like, yeah. I feel like I always drive up to SoCal. I want to go like Chicago. Mm-hmm. I was hoping Twitch can be in Chicago, yeah. like New York or something. That yeah. is sick. Yeah. Vegas is still close enough that it's not like out of state yeah, enough. You know, you know it's not Vegas. it's not out of state enough. Yeah. <laughs> it's like right facts, there. Facts. All right, homies. I'm uh I'm ending the stream. This is yeah. Hotline Ching. Um Smash Your Magazine, K Marth. And uh we're gonna read G Babe. Yeah. Hell yeah. Bye Nobi. Have a good night. Bye, Bye everyone. Maybe. See you, homies. Peace, peace. Peace, y'all. Oh, fuck.